Good morning, guys. So uh, today I want to do a video about specifically the Milwaukee uh, M18 Fuel uh, 12 amp hour battery. Last week I did a video uh, posing the question on whether you could use the Milwaukee string trimmer in your lawn care business. Basically, it was just uh, you know a battery test, uh, seeing how many batteries you would need to get through the day. Um, so uh, I'll leave a link to that video that you can watch. Basically, that's a, a almost kind of like a part one. Uh, so part two uh, of this video here uh, basically uh, is specifically dealing with just the 12 amp hour battery. Uh, so I've got uh, the same mowing route today, the same houses to do, um, but uh, I'm going to be starting off uh, with the 12 amp hour battery. And I want to see, um, you know, how many houses uh, I can get done on the 12 amp hour battery versus uh, the uh, 9 amp hour battery that I started with last week. Uh, all right, so uh, let's get started. Okay, guys, so here we are at house number two. Um, as you can see, after that first house, still obviously a full battery uh, charge on that uh, 12 uh, amp hour battery. Uh, so let's get onto it. Okay, so end of house number two, and we are at full battery. Okay guys, here we are, house number three. Let's get to it. House number three, let's see. Down to three bars left. Okay, house number four, still three bars. Okay, so here we are at house number five. Okay, house number five is done. Where are we at? Still three bars. Pretty good. Okay guys, getting ready for house number six. This is this uh, house that when using the nine amp hour battery, I didn't think it would actually make it through. Uh, and uh, it actually did make it through. It had one bar left on the nine amp hour battery. So uh, let's get started. Okay. 
Okay guys, let's see, after house number six. Showing two bars left. Pretty decent. Okay guys, so here we are at house number seven. Uh, this was the house where when uh, I was uh, using the nine amp hour battery, uh, that the battery had uh, one bar left when I started. I thought the battery was gonna die on the last house. I came to this one and it died halfway through uh, the front yard. Uh, so here we are with the 12 amp hour battery. Let's get started. Okay, so house number seven, and we're still going. Still with two bars left. That's pretty awesome, guys. Okay, so here we are at house number eight. Okay, so after house number eight, showing one bar. So here we are at uh, house number nine. Okay, so there we go, nine houses done. And we're still one bar. And it's holding steady, it's not flashing, so it's still got some juice. Okay, so here we are at number 10. Okay, so let's see, after number 10, still a single solid light on the meter there. That's awesome guys. 10 houses down on one single charge so far. So luckily, number 11 is right there across the street. Let's get to it. Okay guys, so the battery died just as I went to the backyard. It had enough juice here, um, 
and was feeling really good. Uh, you know, I let go of the trigger, went around to the backyard, pressed the trigger and nothing. Uh, so let's check out uh, the meter. So it's the flashing single light. She's done. So there you go guys, the Milwaukee M18 12 amp hour high output battery. Uh, just absolutely awesome that I was able to get through 10 and a half houses uh, trimming with a Milwaukee string trimmer uh, on that single battery and single charge. I uh, would have never uh, imagined that if you asked me, uh, you know, how far it would have uh, been able to get me. I'll leave a link uh, below to uh, the video I did last week of whether or not you can use the Milwaukee string trimmer uh, in your lawn care business. Basically, uh, same uh, style video, the same houses. I start out with uh, three batteries, two 9 amp hour batteries plus the 12 amp hour battery. And that's what brought about this video was what if I started with a 12 amp hour battery uh, and, you know, comparison with those exact same houses and see uh, how many of the same houses in the same conditions uh, just a week apart, um, you know, how many houses I could do on a 12 amp hour battery versus uh, that uh, six amp hour battery, or sorry, the nine amp hour battery. And uh, if you uh, watch that video, uh, you will have seen that uh, with a nine amp hour battery, um, you know, on average, I was able to get through six houses. Uh, and uh, between uh, the two uh, nine amp hour batteries, uh, I uh, managed to do 11 houses and still had uh, one tiny little bar uh, flashing uh, and was maybe able to squeeze out a 12th house. Uh, between those two batteries. So absolutely awesome that with the uh, 12 amp hour battery, I'm able to do uh, almost 11 houses, 10 and a half houses to be exact, of those same houses uh, on one single battery, one single charge. Just absolutely awesome. So if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. If you haven't subscribed yet, consider subscribing. Uh, leave a comment down below and let me know what you think of the Milwaukee uh, 12 amp hour battery. Have you tried it yet? Uh, what tools have you tried it in and have you seen a difference uh, you know in uh, the amount of runtime compared to what you're uh, normally used to in your Milwaukee tools so that's it for this one guys here's to wishing you guys all overwhelming success and freedom in your lawn care business bye for now